In this video, we'll be installing NQ panel board neutral kits. Let's see what's in the box. These are representative samples of the selection of NQ neutrals that we have available. I'm going to install a 200% neutral onto this NQ panel board. The first step in the process is to remove the two screws that hold it in place. I'm using a square drive screwdriver. The neutral simply slides off the end of the panel board. The new neutral is placed on the rails, you slide it into place. You can reuse the two screws that you just removed, or you can use the two screws that come with the kit. I'll now demonstrate how to install an NQNL2 ACC wide neutral kit that also has rail extensions and a dead front extension. First, I'll have to remove this neutral. Install the neutral by sliding it onto the rails into place. You can utilize the two screws that you just removed or two screws that come in the bag assembly with the kit. In the bag assembly, you'll find rail splices and the six inch rail extensions, along with a bag assembly full of, of hardware. The rail extensions and the splices go together via two little notches on the side, two lances that insert into a cavity in the rail itself. We'll now place the rail extensions on the rail splices using the same lance and notch in the rail as we did on the main rail. I'll now install the six inch dead front extension on the dead front assembly. The lug cover is removed by removing these two screws. The cover can be discarded. You can reuse the two screws that you just removed from the dead front assembly or you can use two new screws that come with the bag assembly. You can now set your dead front assembly aside and complete installation of your panel board.